<clears throat> so I think we decided that um, we decided that it's stupid to uh, switch to like minimal overlay when I'm in uh, scenes cutscenes it's kind of dumb wasn't working out as the way I expected it to so we're gonna just not not do that anymore about ready to start now yeah <sighs> let me just check some check my quality Yeah, we did unlock the black suit. The suit that I like. <sighs> I'm already tired. <laughs> we just started. I should check out Lee's office. Something wrong with the sound? Oh, okay. That was good. Need help with those veggies? I learned a long time ago, you're more help staying out of the kitchen than in it. Oof. I'm a little tangled. All right. Pete, glad to see you're okay. Hanging Lincoln. in there. May said you were hmm. at the this office is locked. How do I get in there? Thanks. I appreciate it. Well, <laughs> you interrupted the cutscene from a random. Maybe there's a vent somewhere. All right. That'd be a little more finesse huh. than that. But... Never seen that room before. Can I look? I must, be, I must be do something. There we go. Oh, that's interesting. Whoa, what the? the high voltage lines. What needs this much power? I understand, but the account number is in Mr. Lee's office, which is inaccessible. I will call you back as soon as I can get that information. Uh huh. No, I don't know when that will be. I can get it for you right now. That room I saw from the crawl space. It should be right on the other side of the shrine. Lee's parents. Looks like there's a keyhole in the frame. I thought Lee's parents abandoned him. Why build a shrine to the people who threw you away? Oof. Misses his parents, dude. Oh, what does it say? Lee really did care about May. Hope this means she's out of danger. Dear May, very soon you'll hear stories about me. Stories claiming I'm a terrorist and a murderer. These stories will be true. 
But the story we wrote together, a story of feast, is also true. I want you to know that I always believed in our mission. Uh, I wasn't a front. It wasn't a front it w or a show. It was an honest expression of my heart. When you help someone, you truly do help everyone. Don't, f please don't let my failings shake your belief. You are strong, me, strong enough to tell the new story of the feast, one unburdened by my faults. Thank you for all you've done, Martin. Okay, I guess this is, this is the end of a. Uh, this is the end of feast. <laughs> Lee's journal. Key. Bet this fits the lock in the portrait. Yeah, we could read that, but nah, it's okay. I think we're good. Some kind of puzzle lock. That seems right. Oh, oh I see. Okay. Not much of a lock. What the hell? How is the easiest thing in my life? What are you hiding, Lee? Well, I want to see this one first. He's Damn. giving his powers to the others. How does Lee imbue these with his power? Bioelectric induction? Compressed phase shift? It's not scientific, bro. He sure is obsessed with masks. Is it a Jungian thing? Like, he needed to pretend to be someone else to let his darkest feelings out? Pretended to be a demon until he became one. I'm not sure if it's pretend. Hey, look, it's negative parents. Maybe. Oh, wait. Can feel my power growing. Feeding off my anger. Father would say I've lost the path of balance that he could never understand. The only way to fight a monster is to become one. Fighting fire with fire? I thought that wasn't, wasn't oh, good. This is the folder MJ found at the auction house. This might help us figure out what Lee's planning next. Wait, he got a. She, they got hold of it. I thought Mary Jane took it. Oh, I'm taking it. Okay. Oh, rip. Yeah. It's a burn room, wired to destroy evidence. Oh, this is it. Wait, can we stop it? No, I guess not. Wait. One more. Oh, okay. The police had found this. Or May. Don't want to think of what could have happened. Drop down. Now, how do I get out of here? Of course. Hello, Peter. Mr. Lee. Uh-oh. I thought you were out of town. Did you find what you were looking for? Martin, you're back. You get that. Thank you. And heading off again shortly, I'm afraid. Just needed a few things from my office. You must have heard about City Hall. A yes. Tragic. Peter was there. He was very lucky. And an Osborne rally. I didn't know you were a fan. Not. Well, what matters is you are both safe. Amen. But the bombers are still out there. Who knows what they've planned next? Oh, I don't think you or May have anything to worry about. As long as you stay away from places you're not supposed to be. Well, I should go. When will you be back? Is that a threat? That when like a my threat work is me. done.
That looked like a threat to me, boy. Excuse me. His eyes are already glowing. Wait, wait, wait! Peter, Peter's not one to fight back. Come on. He doesn't know shit. Oh. Can we catch him? You know where he is? No. Look at that tower, I guess. Captain Watanabe. I finally got your evidence. Head to the Feast Center in Chinatown. What am I going to find? A nice lady named Mae Parker. And some really weird stuff hidden in Lee's office. But listen. He's got another attack planned. Where? When? Still working on oh, that, but to. I think he's going to use something called Devil's Breath. Sounds destructive. What is it? Wait. A substance created by Oscorp. Probably a oh. bioweapon of some kind. I have a folder full of info on it. I'm holding on to it for now. I'll send copies as soon as I can. Okay, we'll check his office. If the evidence stands up, I'll put out an AP. MJ, hey! Just checking in. Peter, hey, can I call you back? I think you'll want to hear this. Wait, why are you whispering? Just in the middle of something. Uh -oh. How about we catch up over dinner? That place? Oh, sure. I'll even cook. Cool. See ya. Wait, remember how you told me about Lee's corrupting touch? I think I just saw it in action. How? Some perfectly nice homeless people just jumped me. Thing is, they had glowing eyes, and I remembered Yuri telling me something similar about the guard who released eyes? Shocker. Glowing eyes? So Shocker was all negative, dude. For Lee? What the hell? <sighs> it's all connected. There's more, but I guess we'll talk about it at dinner. Another camera. Looks like Black Cat, all right. Oh, poor spider. I know I disappointed you when I couldn't go straight, but why mess with perfection? I think they sell rare wine here. She's branching out. Gotta try and get ahead of her. What's our mission? Right oh, now? hi, Doctor. How are you? Parker! Exciting news. Come by the lab. Uh, like, now? This is my defining moment. Can't wait to show you. Cool. Um, I've got dinner plans. Can I come by later? Dinner can wait. You need to see this, Peter. Uh, okay. Uh, you right got time, dude. There's plenty of time. Wonder if this means I have a job again. Guess I can stop by just for a minute. Ooh. Once again, defend myself against the spurious claims from McDonald's Mac Gargan, a.k.a. The Scorpion. Yes, as I fully disclosed, I bankrolled the experiment that gave him superior strength, speed, and that unsightly cyborg tail. The idea was to create an anti-Spider-Man who is not a threat and stops menaces. I well, I mean, no you created a nice Spider-Man, that's for sure. resume said psycho with a poisoning fetish? His lawsuit is a transparent attempt to reduce his sentence at the raft by put... Anti-Spider-Man mission accomplished. It's too bad he wasn't as good as Spider-Man. Hey, doctor. Hello, Peter. I'll be just a minute. 
Isn't this the same wow. lab? Look at all this new stuff. Aim. Aim? Advanced idea mechanics. We really need to get better about organizing our workspace. Welcome to the. Uh... Oh, it's over here. Our first volunteer subject, Lance Corporal Texador. Lost his arm overseas and now just wants to hug his dog. Where did you get all this equipment? Called in hug his dog or finger. daughter? I didn't, I didn't catch that. Loans. If that he just wants to hug his dog. <laughs> this time's <laughs> going to be <laughs> Poor guy just wants to hug his dog. So we give him an arm. You've been busy. Just getting started. Wow. You know, until now, we've been looking at prosthetics from the wrong perspective. Why restore people to what they were when we can make them better? Okay. Well, you can barely... I think that should do you it. can barely replace the arm. <laughs> like, what? <laughs> you... you Arm went to shit last time, didn't it? Ready? <laughs> Everything okay? Rip. Damn it! This is all your fault, Norman, you son of a- Well, I know who you're not voting for in the next election. Sorry. Maybe you should stick to the basics, I Norman. I have a habit of making bad jokes in tense situations. <laughs> uh, it was a good joke, Parker. Just a bit of an overreaction on my part. No, don't worry. Why don't you take a break? I'll, uh, I'll clean this up and uh, get us ready for another test. <sighs> another test? What do you mean, like the... So, uh, hope you don't mind me asking, but... Puzzle shit. Seems you and Norman have a bit of a history. We were lab partners in college. Became friends. Decided to start a business. We both had visions of changing the world just in different ways. Wait, you were at Oscorp when it started? I'm half the reason it's called Oscorp. In grad school, everyone called us the O's. <sighs> Add Corp to that and, well, it is a catchy name. Well, why'd you leave? I thought it was Osborne, not Oz. Norman became more and more obsessed with genetics. He started a project I considered unethical. And there was this... Anyway, lawyers got involved. I chose to leave in exchange for a settlement. But that money didn't last very long. I've relied on grants ever since. If this project doesn't work... Don't worry. It'll work. Uh, let, me, let me just fix this up. Yeah, as long as you stop screwing it up. Like I'm fresh coffee. Improve human arm. Let's just, let's just make a regular arm first. Be sure to run a diagnostic on the control unit. Yeah, yeah, Could yeah. be a short. <clears throat> I got this, bro. Huh. No good. Gotta reroute this circuit. There you go, Doc. Oh, why don't you do the honors this time? I think we did it. Next step, neural interface. That's a lot of work for you to do by yourself. 
sure you can handle it? Apparently not, judging by today's debacle. Because I still haven't That's found another fact. job. My funds are still... I know. It's okay. Don't worry, I'll figure it out. What's a few bucks when you're trying to change the world, right? You're a bitch. It's changing the I'm world. I'm just... <laughs> I'm, I wouldn't do that if I was him, but... Doctor, I need to go, but I'll be back later. Don't worry, oh. the work will still be here when you get back. What's that? What's what? What is the bonuses? Oh, okay, let's try it. Cool. Logic controller for the micro cables Doc's been theorizing. more simple AI that'll improve the prosthetics functionality over time. Welcome to the future. I hate the directional ones. That confuses me. I'm stupid. Just did a little one, I guess. Oh, I don't have no ones. has a tiny brain. Doc dove right in with the intracranial interface. Oh yeah, he did. He totally dove into that, dude. The neural interface along with the spectral magnetism. Can't believe he did all that work by himself, dude. It's crazy. I guess when you run out of money, that's what you gotta do. Might as well get used to it. <laughs> it's not funny. What is this? It's a three-way? So we do this one? Here? How do we get to- how do we get to that? That makes no sense. That was dumb. Not a hundred percent stable. I was locked. Okay. We need to refine this design. Goodbye. What's this? Today is the day. Grant review. We're ready. The work has progressed at a remark. More. Spectrographs. Oh, this is the other one. What is this one? Parker, we've been focused on limb replacement. Connecting nerves at severed extremities, replicating the function of lost appendages. Yeah. But what if instead we gave people something they've never seen? Something yeah, but straight from the mind. Unchain all of us from the bodies we've been born with. But like I said, you didn't make a proper awesome on the first. So. Beautiful. Doesn't make doesn't make sense that you'd hmm. make a better What's Doc one? working on with this. Looks like another potential prosthetic contact material. Um. So 
So we need one with three, right? Like this. And then one. There's no one. Well, there's one, but it's not gonna help us. So we need like two and two. Two. And two. There you go. Three. And two. Two. Whoop. Whoop. Oh, it's already taken. Not a three. This one. And one. Cool. Oh, Hydrogel IPN. Yeah, totally, this looks dude. promising. Yeah. It'd be a great tissue interface. Of course. Why didn't I think of that? Hmm. What was Doc working on with this? <laughs> I have no clue, dude. I don't know what the hell I'm doing. Let's subtract. And this one. Cool. And this one. And subtract one from the side. Oh, two. No, nah, that's not gonna work. This one will work here. And then this one. And this one. Great conductivity. Not sure about long term wear and tear, though. Yeah, that's what I was worried about. Too. Easily. I was worried about the, the durability as well. Was testing the biocompatibility of graphene. Biocompatibility of graphene? I'll tell you, it works very well. This is the, um, I don't know if you can see it properly. No, you can't see shit. Okay, wait. Nah, I'll just, I'll just tell you. Um, in grade six, I was having a pencil fight with one of my, with one of my classmates, and he ended up stabbing the point of his pencil into my finger, and to this day. Uh, I have a little gray mark because the pencil lead was like lodged in the the walls of the slit bef before it healed, and it healed over. So I have this little gray dot with the with the graphene still on my finger. It's crazy, bro. <laughs> so yeah, biocompatibility. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty compatible. I think it stayed there for a long time. Not to be a scientist to tell you that. This does not work. Would this work? I'm stupid. That doesn't work either. We don't have any more subtractions, so we need to just do it. These two work, and then stuck again. So this one has to change. This one. There you go. This one. If we're removing one from here. Maybe this one. No, don't. That's not where you go. Did I just do the same thing over again?
What do we need? None of the other ones go... Well, this one does. The one that... This one, right? But this one is useless then completely because... Now the ones don't do that, but we need to fill the box because one, two, three, four. No, we don't. No, we don't. There you go. Not great. Pretty high cytotoxicity. Not sure I'd use this as tissue interface. Running tests on carbon nanotube biocompatibility. Carbon nanotube. That works. That does not work. One at the end. This doesn't work anymore. Um, there's one at the end. This one will eliminate the one that we need. Can't do that one. This. And there's no single one at the end. So it'll always get doubled up unless. We do that. So that's what we need. Oh, uh, we have three and one. We have one here. And we don't have three. We have three at the end. There you go. So that works. This one needs to double up all of them. And we have this one. There you go. Decent candidate for a direct tissue interface. But I feel like we can do better. What are we searching for? Something to attach to the back of your neck? Hmm, graphene. But the structure is super unique. Another what is graphene? This? There's a lot of freaking choices here. This one. No. That's close. That's not gonna help us. Three. That helps. And then we have one at the end. Cool. Two at the end. Just two at the end. There you go. Oh, awesome! been nano-latticed. 
Wow, that's strong. Could be a great structural element for a prosthetic. Good nano lattice. We have two more. Let's just do it. Doc's messing around with superconductors. Superconductors. Is she to be really cold for that? Kind of weird. I don't think that'll work. If <laughs> If a neural interface that was a superconductor today touched your neck right now, you'd probably just freeze to death. Not freeze to death, but you get like you get like brain freeze in like two minutes. Two minutes, that's a long time. Your skin would freeze off easily though. Cause you gotta be like the temperature of liquid nitrogen or something, right? That kind of helps. But do we have a two stick? We do not have a two stick. This thing gets cancelled out by this one. That doesn't work. There. And there. We got one and then two at the end here, right? That doesn't fit. One. This one? Yeah. And then we got two, two, and two. Right? But we have three, we have three chances to get it. So two. Two. And two. Very cool. Complex oxide ceramic. Perfect type 2 superconductor. It'll run hot, but not hot? good for an outboard controller? Superconductor that's hot? I don't, I don't know about that. Seems a little inconsistent there. Some kind of polymer. Pretty sure that a superconductor at, at room temperature is too hot. So remove one in the middle, right? We don't have one in the middle though. We have one and we have this one. No. This one. Let's see if these if we need those two to later. Um, yeah. No. I think we might need it. Oh. Oh yeah, I forgot about this one. I was looking only this one. That's good. That's good. And I guess all of them have to fit. Ooh. This one probably has to go here. This one goes here. And then... Subtracting two at the end. No. Two and one. And then this one does not work. I'm pretty sure this one this one goes here. Wait. Am 
minus one and one. We don't have that. Start from the beginning. We just put this one here. We have two minus in the middle. Oh. This one works. That's one. No. We need... This one should go here with this one, right? I think. And then we have minus. No. This one gets completely canceled out. Can we skip it yet? I think I'm dumb. That works. Okay, there you go. That's that's really good. There you go. This is awesome. A self-healing polymer. This stuff will survive almost anything. Okay. It's back to the real game now. What's this? Wonder if I could 3D. What is this stuff, Doc? Looks like armored plating. Defense prototypes. Fascinating, really. AIM has requested a number of samples of my work. Who am I to deny them my genius? Ah. Think these are 3D printers? Of course. Well, who was AIM though? Interesting. 